How's it going everyone? This is Medina from TGN, just bringing you guys another online match. I know I haven't posted here in a while, at least not any gameplay, but that's all changing. I'm back. I'm going to start making some videos, and if it's not going to be me, it's going to be people from my channel. I have a new fighting game channel called TGN Fighting. It's a hub channel. I am the general, or channel manager, I'm sorry, of it, and we're going to be having a bunch of fighting game videos, not of just Mortal Kombat. It's going to be everything and anything fighting game related, King of Fighters, Tekken, Street Fighter, Ultimate Marvel, you name it, it's going to be there. I'm really excited to start it. If you're interested in joining it, just send me a, um, just go to the, the hub channel. The links will be in the description box, of course. You can find out all the information you need right there on how to apply and everything else. So if you're really interested in joining or being part of it and just uploading content, you know, that's great. I'd love to have you or anybody for that matter. Um, real quick now, I'm just going to talk about this gameplay. I have a um, rain guide actually that I'm working on. It should be, the beginner guide should be done by the time this video uploads. And it's going to be found on my, um, I'm going to annotate it of course, but it's also going to be found on TGN Fighting, my channel. Um, I'm currently doing an online match against Rastakar81, who is a pretty okay opponent. And for those people who don't know me, I'm an offline tournament player, so I really don't like playing online. But I sometimes need to. Like in situations like right now, I want to upload content, I want to help people, I want to do guides, so I kind of need to do it online. Right there, I did EX uh, Roundhouse, which gives you one hit of armor. So on jump ins, it's so good to use, and I was going to punish his, uh, his, his, um, his whiff right there on the uh, dash. And there's that geyser kick, really good anti-air. And I talk about all these things in my guide. I also talk about this lightning into water bubble, just bring your opponent close to you, and then go for the throw mix-up with that water bubble reset. I should have been expecting the wake-up attack right there, but um, this is my first time ever playing someone, so it always takes a gamer to really read somebody. And if you notice, what I do is I do EX bubble, and then it drains his meter, and I kind of just messed up the timing right there, which is just happens online. And just a little bit of health. I'm just trying to play it safe. There it is. Let him mess up. And then the match is over. That's how you play this game. You just have to wait for your opponent to mess up. Don't start doing wild things when you see the match is over. Just relax. Take it slow. You have plenty of time. You have plenty of health. You don't need to rush or make any mistakes. Just be safe and calm. And you will win the match, everyone. Um, Rain, I really like. City Junior, Book Burning, those people like that, they have absolutely fantastic reigns. And I learn a lot from them, and I just like him, the way he plays. He's such an offensive character, and that's the kind of person I am. I'm total rushdown, so someone like Rain is somebody that I like a lot. Right here he goes to Scorpion, so I was like, oh man, his Cabal really wasn't that good. So I, I, picked, I figured he was going to use, he was going to be an average online Scorpion player. So I really wasn't looking forward to this match, but I'm like, alright, you know, let's, let's, let's get this over with, come on. And um, he actually wasn't that bad with Scorpion. Um, he he was doing things that normal online Scorpions do. Oh, I totally missed that uppercut. And uh, just I always end up missing uh, combos online, especially when I, I really don't play it. And the timing is completely different. You really gotta adjust to it. And he keeps getting me with freaking Hellfire or Spears. And I was like, oh damn it, he was making me mad because he was giving me um a lot with that stuff. And here I saw him whiff on the spear. And so because he did that, I just uh, decided to go for lightning into water bubble and then bring him in close to me. So I see right here that he's able to do combos. I was expecting Hellfire and I, I just uh, tech roll back and uh, get out of it. And so like, like I said, he, he actually was, really wasn't that bad. He kept getting me with that spear though. And in this first round, I had Breaker, but I'm like, you know what? I'm not going to use it. I'm just going to save my meter for the next round. And it's a pain off for me. Um, one thing I should have been doing is I kept going for the 4-3 the into roundhouse. But it wasn't working. My, my pressure wasn't working, and I should have mixed it up. I should have done things that I talk about in my guide. So once again, check out that guide. It's just a beginner's guide. and talk about basic things. Right here, I catch him with the roundhouse finally, and I just jump out of that spear. Once again, punch the spear with lightning and bring him close to me with that water bubble. That, that lightning is really good for mid-screen if it does hit. And he anti-airs me with the freaking sweep of all things. Here we go, full punish, and I got x-ray. I'm feeling happy. I'm feeling good. I get the combo. 4-3 x-ray, mother... Ooh, break your freaking elbow, mother... Kick him in the face! So kick him in the face and then get the geyser kick for 54% damage. Not bad, not bad at all. Was it a waste of meter? I don't know, probably, but it felt good. This is online. You don't have to take it serious, everybody. You could do things, fool around, and just get combos. And right here, I, I didn't want him to break. I know he had breaker. So all I do is do a water bubble in the air to finish him off. Because water bubble, I mean, um, 
the squirtle gun it's unbreakable so that's uh, that's just a little things you should know with rain he tried punishes me uh punishes me with uppercut but i end up just going for a down three instead of punishing him i could have got a full punish there but it's okay um jump out of the hellfire once again and he's just swinging away in the air i don't know what he's trying to hit and he's able to get that uh that kick into throw which is actually really good it has um pretty good i want to say priority but it beats out most things. And here we go. Here's my bread and butter that I actually hit online, surprisingly. And then I get him with a water bubble reset into a throw. He wasn't expecting it. I was expecting a wake up attack, so that's why I decided to do EX Roundhouse because Enhanced Roundhouse ends up beating out most uh, wake up attacks, and it's actually good against good to use against other people's wake ups. Here he does again. I was about to do the bread, do the bread and butter, but he um he ended up breaking there. So we're a little about even right now. About he has a little bit more meter than me. And full punish right here, and that's all she wrote. Uppercut and game over. And uh, that's that's my rain online. He's not bad. My rain offline. He's not that bad either. But um, and that's been all, guys. Thanks for watching this match. I've been Medina. It's been a pleasure. Please check out TGN Fighting. Subscribe. Do what you need to do. Check out more videos there from our directors and stuff. If you want to know more about rain, check out my rain guide on TGN Fighting. I'm Medina, and I'm out.